What's going on YouTube? Rob A again, and today we're going to be taking a look at LEGO Star Wars set number 75040, General Grievous' Wheel Bike. Uh, this set has 261 pieces and retails for about $25. Uh, you also get two minifigures in this set. You get Obi-Wan Kenobi and General Grievous, and both are listed as new figures. Um, though I could have sworn that I had already gotten this General Grievous in another set. Maybe there is a slight variation, maybe there's a color difference or something like that. Um, but it says it's new, so I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to trust him on this one. Um, anyway, so here you get the wheel bike. As you can see, it's got a big like clear piece in the middle to kind of simulate nothingness, I guess. <laughs> um, so it's recreating the scene from the movie, basically, uh, minus the big goofy lizard bird thing um, and then on the back here you can see uh, it's got it's got legs that pop out so it can kind of uh, you know get around on all fours and then that folds up and you can kind of push it along so pretty cool um, it's got flick fire missiles of course it needs to have flick fire missiles can't not have flick fire missiles and uh, yeah uh, so overall it looks like a pretty cool set I'm gonna go ahead and put it together and we will check it out in hand in just a moment all right, guys. So here we have General Grievous wheel bike, and um, yeah, we're gonna check out the minifigs first, as we always do. And we'll start out here with Obi Wan Kenobi. He's got a little uh, electro shock stick. I don't know what it's called. Don't correct me. I don't care. Uh, he's got a little blaster going on here as well. Some of that action. Uh, and yeah, he's uh, he's pretty nice looking. Very stern stern look upon his face he like he knows that Anakin is just a whiny little piece of junk and uh, nice little belt very nice printing on this guy uh, and he's got some back printing on his face as well very angry uh, angry face like he's ah oh, I can't believe I can't believe I had to be in all three of those uh, yeah so very, very nice little minifig there. Uh, and then we'll move right on to the other minifigure in this set, uh, General Grievous. And uh, here he is. He's got some lightsabers. He comes with four lightsabers, two green and two blue. Uh, the kind of weird thing is uh, Obi-Wan does not come with any uh, in this set, which is kind of a bummer. I mean, I guess four, I guess, in one set they figured is enough. But still, still, Obi-Wan needs a lightsaber. And, uh, yeah, Grievous is here. He does not have a cape, but he does have, <clears throat> they, they claim this is an all-new minifig, and it kind of is, uh, just because he's in white now, rather than, uh, rather than the kind of beige that he was in his last set, which I think was his, like, Starfighter or whatever, whatever the last set he came in, uh, was. Uh, but yeah, it's a very nice little minifig. Kind of the same same body as a skeleton or a droid. He's got his head on a little stalk here. He can he can wave it up and down. A little close up of the face there, and he does have extra arms that attach to his normal arms, and you can pull those off to kind of simulate just the regular uh, you know regular situation, and then plug them right on when you want him to go all out with the four four lightsabers but we are going to leave those off for the time being uh, because it is time to show you uh, the wheel bike itself and here it is it is a definite improvement over the original um, I mean it doesn't come with the giant bird lizard thing but uh, <laughs> you know it actually rolls I, I can't say nicely but it rolls um, yeah, so there's there's some things going on here. Uh, so as you can see, the wheel itself is made up of all these little, I guess I'll call them, for lack of a better term, ATV parts. Um, a lot of those, I think 12 of those guys, and then you've got a ton of, if you want silver, if you want the silver little uh, great pieces, this is the set to get, because there's a ton of them in here. Um, I know there's like at least 12 for the, uh, for the wheel, there's a couple on the sides and everything, so... It's a good amount. Um, the wheel spins very nicely in there. Uh, you've got some guns mounted over here. You've got a flick fire on that side, which you know, great. Can't can't have enough of those. Um, and uh, yeah, nice little backing here. 
And of course a seat for Grievous himself, which comes with this little uh, little control disc that is a printed piece for whatever reason. I, they felt the need to include that, that's fine. And what you can do is just sit, you pop Grievous' little footsies up here, and you just kind of tuck him in and pop his head back on, because that certainly likes to fall off. And then he can uh, he can control the wheel bike, just like so. Woo! And when he needs to make a getaway, I guess by jumping around, he can uh, deploy the legs on this thing. So they do have legs. Uh, they pop out, and then you get these little claw bits for the feet. Just pop those out. And the legs are on the uh, standard Lego ball joints that we all have come to know and love at this point. Here we go. Do, 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 do. And there it is. He's on a walking wheel bike now. So, yeah, there's that. Uh, <laughs> you also do get a bunch of these nice sand blue pieces, a ton of little cheeses in that color, um, as well as some triangular plates. So very, very cool. Um, yeah, it's it's a neat set. Uh, and again, like I said, it's certainly a marked improvement over the original. I will say that the build um, was not, not that interesting or fun. Um, a lot of repetition going on. You're building the bike, or the wheel, rather. Uh, and that's all, that's one step, basically, is this whole wheel. And then each side piece here and here are basically all just repeated steps uh, with just a few variations to make either the gun platform or the seat and then you've got the four legs which are all basically the same so it's really it was a super fast build it didn't take any time at all and if you're if you're into these sets for the build itself definitely pass on this uh, if you're into this for the minifigs or the vehicles or if you're just you know star wars completionist huge fan whatever uh then sh sure why not um it's it's an inexpensive set and that's definitely uh definitely a plus um but overall i don't i didn't really find anything terribly special or exciting about this uh this set um it's just another another star wars vehicle we certainly no end of those, but uh, you do get a bunch of lightsabers and some guns. Uh, I believe he's got a gun somewhere on here, too. I thought maybe... Oh, no, but he can clip one on here in the back if you want. Um, but yeah, nothing really to write home about, but it's not a bad set overall. Um, so yeah, <laughs> and again, uh, just to show you guys, he can... Just fold these up once again to uh, to put it in wheelie mode, and then roll around and run over this guy. <laughs> so I think that's gonna do it for this review, guys. I want to thank you so very much, as always, for watching. Uh, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I've got more Lego coming up real soon, uh, as well as some hopefully some new Transformers coming along in the very near future, and all kinds of other stuff. So stay tuned for that. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna see you in the next one. Bye for now.